National Farm Safety and Health Week has been held for more than 70 years as a recognition of the dangers of farming and a reminder to keep safety in mind during the hectic fall harvest season. Data from the U.S. Bureau of Labor Statistics in 2019 showed an equivalent of 23 deaths per 100,000 farm workers. And it's always my hope that it just provides them a little more to think about and helps them think twice about some of the things they might be doing. Extension Farm Health and Safety Educator Emily Kreckelberg says that while farm equipment can be dangerous, people have the most impact on farm safety. It's important to remember that a tractor just sitting in the yard isn't going to cause an accident. So it's usually operator error, something has gone wrong. And so I always tell people, you know, you are your most valuable asset on the farm, but you're also your biggest liability. And so by emphasizing the health piece of this as well this week, it really allows us to help show people how their well-being will influence their ability to be safe on the farm. Getting sleep, eating well, connecting with loved ones, and even taking brief breaks from the hectic farm schedule can be helpful in keeping fall safe on the farm. Get some sleep. You know, six, seven hours is better than four. Do what you can. Uh, make sure that you're eating well, you know, more than just pop and candy bars, but making sure you're having some good snacks, drinking lots of water, and then just taking some time for yourself. I know you can't take a whole afternoon off, but I really encourage people to give yourself just 10 minutes every single day where, you know, you're not bothered by the farm or things at home. Maybe you go for a walk, you read the newspaper or a book you really enjoy. Just taking that little bit of time to let yourself regroup and recharge can make a lot of difference. This is Lynn Kettleson reporting.